would like you to comment on how did you translate this very personal experience of uh, looking at a painting uh, for the masses and how could you do it so successfully? First of all, let me contradict. It was not me who did it. The film is done by Amit Datta. But my point or my contribution was basically that I already influenced Amit how to look at these paintings and that we really took a lot of time to talk about each and every painting uh, with the help of the monograph of B.N. Goswami who has written very beautifully long entries to all the paintings which come in the film. And then that we really went together to the sites and saw and, and tried to experience a bit the at court atmosphere which prevailed in the hills and that we discussed on the site problems of perspectives or problems of symmetry or how a picture is done and what we can see on the site itself. So uh, the film was slowly developing in our minds. It was not done uh, here is the book and this is what we do and, and this is the result and this is the date and here's the money. Uh, no, we, we really worked together carefully and thoughtfully because my intention was to show that Nainzuk is a discerning artist. He's not just a repetitive worker who, who does what his forefathers all, all have done. He is looking around what is happening. He takes into account paintings of other workshops, Mughal workshops for instance, and like this we felt we should be a bit similar in our approach. And Amit very fast grasped the essential ingredients of Nainzuk's work. For instance, uh, that it is shadowless, or that uh, we he was very particular about the lenses to be used for each shot uh, because he didn't want to have just uh, a Gukasten Bühne, a stage where everything is in a, in a, in a rectangle. Yeah. So you might have seen very often think, uh, pillars were slanting or uh, th this kind of perspective we felt is more appropriate if one wants to translate Nainzuk's aesthetics in a modern aesthetics of a film. And we, with in, we really wanted to deconstruct uh, images a bit too. We, we wanted to not to, we want to, to give the audience always the feeling it, this is an interpretation of our time. Mm -hmm. We don't say it was like this, but if you like to follow us, please come with us. This is what we can offer you as, as a possibility to get involved more in looking at, at Nainzuk's paintings. We did not give solutions. We just thought it's a hint. It, it, it should have a, a, a similar sound, mm -hmm. if you permit, uh, like the Nainzuk painting has what we did. And, uh, I can claim that uh, the conflict at the beginning was my idea, the end was my idea, mm -hmm. but th how it all happened, mm -hmm. and this is what really makes the film an art film, this is all Amit's work. Uh, mostly films on masters, uh, the kind of films that we have seen, you know, they usually have experts talking about uh, masters work. And here is a film that you uh, have tried to create, I won't say make. You have created a beautiful film with a very different perspective, yet you knew that this is for the international audience. Well, uh, the film was pro uh, the, intent t the film was produced for the Riedberg Museum for the exhibition Masters of Indian Painting 1100 till 18, uh, 1900. Mm -hmm. So it was meant to be a film for people who, who come to see Indian paintings okay. to get an idea of the magic world of the Indian, of Rajput paintings, uh, a phrase by Kumaraswamy. So we, we wanted less to teach them, but more to show them 
the world to enter, uh, to enter that and, and have an access to something they have not known up till now. That was the in basically the intention. So we had the film then became much longer than I had intended. My, I had in the beginning said to Amit, we make a 20 minute film, that's the maximum a, a museum viewer can so, do, but now it's much longer. So we made a short version for the, for the museum uh, during the show. So d could you foresee that the film would become so popular and so successful? I mean, it, it's, it's a very beautiful film. It's, each frame is like a painting. And sure. I'd seen very few films of Amit before we started. I mean, and I've seen them only on the computer. Once I saw in Delhi a, f a film of his. And I could see his sincerity and his f capability of being very careful in details mm -hmm. and in composing images and creating yeah, uh, some uneasiness sometimes too in the film. And, and I mean, uh, many parts of the film I find extremely witty as well and, and I could even when I saw it first time I was laughing uh, quite often and uh, yeah I, 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 could, for, I could foresee yeah. that he would create a good film yeah yeah we feel very fortunate to having witnessed this beautiful film in Chandigarh for the first time in India and that's uh, true we'd like to thank you very much for but you have to thank me and Goswami because it is his town and therefore we, I made it a point that we start the film here and the film is dedicated to him. We Professor should not forget. Goswami is ours, so <laughs> yes, <laughs> we keep thanking him all the time. Good. Thank you very much. I thank you for it. Thank you so much.